the kids are up and they're playing in the background, so you're definitely gonna probably hear them. I think they're adorable. When I listen back to the videos, then I hear them. But if you find them overwhelming, you have been warned the kids will be possibly in the background of these next few clips. <clears throat> and I got a frog in my throat. I love how uh, when I hit record, the kids start getting really loud. So, let's put you guys up here. My eyes are up here, not down there. There we go. So, finished my yoga for today. I've done two weeks straight of yoga. As you guys could tell from the little insert of the screen recording that I uh, inserted, um, I did yoga with Adrian. I will link it down below if anyone is curious and wants to start doing their own yoga or incorporating her yoga into your life. It's really funny. I would try to do her 30 day things in the past. But I uh, was never motivated enough to actually do it. And it's like, when I first did it, it was, I first started trying to do yoga consistently after I've given birth to, I've given birth to Aria so like when she was like six months old I started trying to do yoga and I came across Adrienne and I really liked her videos but I never like stuck it through and now here I am over three years later on day 14. It's like a circle. Ending. Anyways, I'm grateful. I'm gonna go make coffee and then at some point I will come back and finish recording this video. I'm not gonna hold myself. I'm not gonna hold myself to a standard of having to record it all during the day or during one setting, because as a mother, it's very impossible, especially when I'm trying to do soft-spoken, more calm, energetically balanced videos. So yeah. Grand Rising is another cold and chilly rising, but it's really pretty it's snowing outside. I'm really grateful for being able to have experienced it and still am experiencing what it feels like to ground with this beautiful element that we are gifted. But now I'm gonna do day 21 of 
doing yoga because I'm just simply trying to do it once a day, every day. I just came back inside from grounding. I completed day 21 of yoga today. Connected with the element of snow. It's so nice stepping on soft, fluffy snow. It's a little chilly this today. That's okay. I really love how after I come in and my feet adjust to being warm, uh, they look refreshed so all the blood rushes down to them and it rejuvenates them and it's just really beautiful. I'm really grateful for being where I'm at within my healing journey of self-love and finding balance. Because love, I say balance because love is nice. It's what everyone should have as a big motivator in their life, but there has to be balance. And that's why I say love and balance. The journey of love and balance. Accepting my bad days for what they are, but still holding love within. Aria's waking up now, guys. So I'll talk to you again when I get the chance. I'll make time to do it tomorrow. Before I have to start working, or... Yeah, I'll make time to do it tomorrow, so that way this video gets uploaded this week. And I welcome you guys into the space. Okay. Till next time, guys. See you. Grand Rising. It's been a few days since I recorded the last part of this video. I'm just gonna put my plugs in real quick. I'm really grateful for these. I think they're really pretty. 
I think this is gonna be the last part to my first video, I guess. I should say what this channel is dedicated for. It's just dedicated to me. Well, simply it's just dedicated to me because it's my channel. Um, but no, it's dedicated to me having a safe space to share what I think and how I feel. I have another channel, which I will leave that somewhere at some point when I feel ready to. And that video, that channel, just it's more, I don't know, it's like my old channel, what I've been holding on to. And I feel my spirituality, so I have a space of free energy, because the people who are subscribed to that channel have been subscribed to that channel for a while. I mean, there's new spiritual people on there because of the videos that I have been posting on there, but I just want to have a more soft-spoken, dedicated place. I like having my things organized. That might have to do with a lot of things, but I like trying to keep myself organized. And I feel this way, it will help. I don't know. It will just help me grow more, more freely, knowing that I have this new space, this fresh energy. Sometimes it's okay to start over, and I'm smiling because you can. Uh, probably hear the muffler in the background. It's just my neighbor leaving. And it makes me smile because of course, when everyone goes to record, there has to be some sort of noise that wants to disturb the peace of recording. But like that's the scene. If we just choose to live in the now moments, we can embody whatever sound almost whatever sound as peaceful like the sound of your neighbor's muffler because he needs a new exhaust system i'm just gonna light this candle that i was gifted it smells really good i wish i could share smells uh through recording but that's not possible yet but it's earth. I mean, crystal. There was a pretty rose, and it was really decorated pretty, but I lit it yesterday. really pretty and it smells good honestly let's use the candle to focus my favorite. honestly Honestly, I inspire to make candles that are similar to this. And honestly, it's just, I really do inspire to make candles like that. And I will. 
helps when the time comes. But yeah, so this channel is going to be dedicated to me speaking more soft-toned, not feeling rushed, not feeling pressured, and just vibing. And that by itself is simply beautiful, at least for me, to me, for me, that's beautiful. focus off with my camera app. That'd be cool. But I know I can't do that. And yeah, I just want a, a fresh, safe space. I'm gonna still use my other channel. It'll be linked below. If you guys wanna check it out. But like, I'm gonna keep that channel dedicated to showing the process of our life and like us moving because we're moving to Colorado soon but like a lot of people who subscribe to my video to that channel are subscribed because of how I used to record I used to do a lot of vlogs and stuff not not spiritual, soft-spoken, healing. I mean, I just started doing that, but I, just, I haven't felt drawn to keep posting on that channel. So I figured I'd just do something like this. And I think ASMR is really cool because if one lets it, as I was saying earlier about the muffler, we just choose to be present within the day-to-day -day sounds that is our life and not expect this quiet, not expect what others have for their, for their presence and our now moments will become that peaceful, tingly, loving sensation that videos trigger. Helps, it helps become present and that by itself is beautiful and I figured having a space dedicated to that while sharing my perspectives on healing and just spirituality in general is something that I'm gonna do and I'm doing it. So, I'm sorry, I'm not really in focus, because as you guys can hear, I turned the autofocus off. Because this lens is very loud compared to the other lenses that I've been recording on. Actually, I've been recording on... This lens. It's the Nikon DX VR 18 to 55 millimeters. This is the lens that the rest of this video has been recorded on, I think. Pretty sure I saw that. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the the beautiful mess that this video is. That's like one thing I'm like emphasizing within myself for this channel. It's not letting myself feel pressured to record a video a certain way and just flow with the energies of how I feel recording. And just slowing it down and appreciating it. Appreciating myself and being grateful. And that's one thing I've learned throughout my whole life in this now moment is that I am grateful. I'm grateful for the good, I'm grateful for the bad. I'm grateful for myself, my good and my bad. Life is beautiful. The ups and the downs, the frequencies that are currently happening around us. How we choose to perceive them is how we choose. And I choose to be more grateful and loving 
and understanding and ultimately I choose my inner balance of my good and my bad and accepting it all and just loving myself and slowing it down just being present so I'm going to stop recording uh, I'm going to make myself a hot chocolate coffee it's so tasty and then I'm going to switch it up a little bit maybe out of this video maybe do my yoga but switching it up would be no I would be switching it up by doing my coffee first I don't know this is just rambling at this point talk to you guys next time I'm gonna go do my now and I'm gonna try to hold on to the presence that are my sounds and my feelings and the sensations that I am I'm going to be grateful for all that flow within and outwards. Till next time, guys. I love you. I love you. Really? You're silly. Hmm. <laughs> yeah.